we want this meeting to be an open space where everybody can talk about what their position is and freely and without judgment. Business owners and neighbors along the Chamberlain Avenue Industrial Center came together Wednesday night to talk about a proposal coming before council Monday that some say they are worried about. We're going to be forced out. They expressed concerns about a plan to open a year round 150 bed shelter operated by the Salvation Army on December 1st. The idea was announced before City Council in September, but no formal ordinance with details has been presented. Salvation Army is acting like this is a number. Some business owners say they are hesitant after the same site run by a different organization held a temporary 30 bed inclement weather shelter last year. They claim people were stealing from cars, defecating on the streets, and hurting businesses. Well, I am extremely concerned that my lobby is going to turn into a place where everyone comes and just sleeps. At the meeting, people say they feel like the process has been rushed with no clear direction. We're hearing empathy, but none of our points are being addressed because there's no plan. I'd like for someone to tell me, hey, you know, Mr. Holman, here's what we're going to do. And Francis Lambert, who is a city council member for the area, sent a representative to collect input at the meeting, while 5th District City Council member Stephanie Lynch attended. You didn't know about it, and that doesn't feel great, okay? And, and I, I get that. You, you didn't know that this was coming. You didn't have ample time. So the, the shelter that was here last year, that weren't great because it wasn't run very well, okay? And so how do we get to address how do we get to the solutions part so that we can have a shelter that is operating at a high quality that's secure one person in attendance vocalized support for the project for the salvation army and say to take care of the externality mention good night and uh, look forward to seeing this approved on the 13th thank you you know, everybody's not on the same page. Gerald Pollard, who experiences homelessness, believes taking care of the vulnerable is a community-wide effort, regardless of where they end up. Everybody can take care of itself, but you can encourage them to do better. You know, don't put them down because what they go through, try to help them on their issues. And just calling on the Salvation Army to publicly release their plan so citizens can see how the propose or how they propose addressing concerns. She is also encouraging the Neighborhood Association to create a direct line of communication between a point person to convey concerns to the Salvation Army. Now the details on how the proposed shelter could be run will be presented on Monday before they are voted on in the following week. In the studio tonight, Maggie Marshall, CBS 6 News.